So last time that we were doing our draft lock, we had uh, beaten Mars. Now I, I did do some honey tree stuff, but sadly I forgot to check this tree before stream, so... Um, yeah, or uh, to um, continue, I got busy, so uh, I wasn't able to check off stream at all, so... Um, yeah, I just put Slav in some honey, so this one I'll check tomorrow. Because uh, six hours away would be like, I would be unable to check it. So, yeah. Good stuff. <laughs> uh, let me also put out the Nuzlocke. Hello. My counter here. Okay. So, um, we did get um, a Cherubi, who I named Mr. Stabby via chat. Um, that was in Floral Minetto. So now I'm I'm trying to get one on Route 205. Um, so we're going to now head north towards um, Eterna City. So our next two our next couple uh, encounters are going to be at Eterna Forest, the old chateau, and Eterna City itself. Let me actually also heal before we proceed. We got berries. What's cool about you know what's cool about doing um, all of this backtracking to to look at the the um, trees is that now I'm gonna have all the berries, every single berry. I will I will have them. <laughs> we will be swimming in berries. I don't think there's a berry a berry. Um. I'm also, so yeah, Valley Windworks, Floral in a Meadow, we cannot do the, uh, the honey tree there. We can do it on Route 205, though. We haven't caught anything there yet. I think everything that would be catchable would be, uh, um, repeats anyway, so, in the, in the grass at the very least. Um... Cool. All right. So those are done. I'm gonna go heal. And then I think I fought all the trainers on Route 205, so it's just going to Eterna City right now, which is good. I'm glad that's the case. Thankfully, we have. Uh, we're at a good level right now, so that's really nice. Only had one one casualty, which is good. Yeah, I fought all these people already. Oh, okay. I don't know if I checked. Are these guys just in bloom right now? Yeah, they're in bloom, okay. So, no, no berries quite yet on those plants. All right, into Eternal Force we go. So Cheryl's going to Join me. Um, now, just for fairness's sake, um, I will, if anything dies, I will still count it, even though Cheryl, like, heals everything that I, anything that I use. Okay, can't catch any of these guys. No need to really grunt. Well, I'm not gonna grunt right now. Um... Is the moss rock. So we're gonna go. I believe there is a uh, a honey tree here. I think. Right.
I don't know, I'll have to double check. Okay, so... Oops. Okay, hi, I'm Link Half here. How are you doing, Dove? I'm doing good. Um, just... Ooh. Uh, just starting my my playthrough here today. I'm sorry I'm a little late, everybody. I had a couple things I had to take care of before stream. Mostly I had to reschedule a doctor's appointment, so... I had to take care of that, but it's all taken care of now. <laughs> um... But it's okay that I'm a little later because I, I'm gonna be, um... Uh, I'm going to be... I don't have to wake up as early uh, tomorrow, so... Because of my doctor's appointment. I need a shower, but I'll be lurking. Okay. Thank you for the lurk. Oh my god! It's Bree! We're... Bree is sending out... I think it was a patch every so I kind of clicked through really fast. Um... Let's see. I mean, we could bring out UCA... For Pachirisu, but um, actually, let's bring on Zub Zub for Wormpole. Uh, but I'm like, Chan I don't know if Chansey can take the hits. Maybe Chansey can take the hits, but. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh sh! Oh my god! Why did I? This was a this was a really bad decision. <laughs> I forgot about Pachirisu, you guys. I was like, oh. We'll give Zub Zub some points. Man! No! We're not gonna give Zub Zub any points. Um... You know what? Maybe we'll have Zub Zub. Maybe we'll have uh, UCA here. Because at least UCA can also lob like shit. Ha! I don't give a shit about your... About your sparks. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's do Rock Throw. I'm Wurmple. Cool. Give Zub Zub some damage points. Yeah, give- giving- just- give Zub Zub the damage. Sorry, I'm- sometimes when I freak out, I don't speak well. I don't speak proper. It's a real- it's a real issue. Alright, I'm gonna- please don't- Nice. Silcoon is out. Woo! You see a girl of 18! No! <laughs> we are not... We are not fucking around with, with self-destruct in a Nuzlocke. Nope. No thank you. Not happening. Just, just N and also O. <gasps> oh, fuck! You have absorbed? That's not good. Okay. <sighs> it's fine. We're fine. <laughs> Damn, double powers fucking suck. You s well, I, I- I can't- I've already- I've already, uh, said no to that. Um... Let me, should, let me manage my reward request. So I will have to reject your- your, uh... Your request there. Uh, it's a little early for a self-destruct move. Relearn it? You you just want me to murder UCA? Just 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 you know for the lulls. Remembers that one randomized sounds like when I start only new explosion. <laughs> oh my god, that's that sucks. That fuck that that sucks right there. Okay. Yeah, it was Bree had Bree had a uh, had a patchy risu. That's cute. Okay. Um It was a joke one anyway. Yeah, I figured. There's your points back. Okay. 
Got a paralyzed heal. Are there any hidden items in the forest? Ah, mm. uh, no. Except for the insect plate. I see it, I see it. Mm -hmm. Two Abras. I don't really have anything for Abra quite yet, so war gun, here we go! Oh shit, let's hope I hidden powers and something. Oh my god, that did so much damage? Holy fuck. These Abra are not fucking around, oh my god. I th no, Abra is not fucking around at all. Like, like, not at all. Okay, fighting. Okay, they're both attacking Chansey. They're both fighting type. Okay. Thank god, thank god it did not have Vormon target Vormon again. That would have sucked. A whole lot. Um... Gonna keep going with 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 uh water gun. Oh shit. Ho <laughs> Oh my goodness. Please kill it. Oh my lord. <laughs> I was really uh re really really playing it close to the wire there. Jeez. Alright. We might want to grind a little bit, then. Oof, okay. Yeah, why don't we grind a little bit? It's okay if I like murder these guys because the only I don't, I don't even really I think the only catch I can get here is is potentially a oh cool I'm stunned nice it's potentially a honey tree honey tree yeah ex eternal forest exterior so we won't be able to get eternal forest. Exterior um, honey tree until after we get cut, so we have to hold off on that one. But for the interior, we're, we're fine. We don't it doesn't matter. Ugh. Cool. Could also do swift. Oh my god, 4 2 why? Okay. Gotta be careful with this budu. <laughs> <sighs> I 
Jesus. Oh god, thank god. Hi, Sad. Oh, so you're going through the forest right now. I really enjoyed the comparison to companion playing in my playthrough. Yeah! Yeah, they are really nice. They're a good time. These were the worst, though, when I did my randomized Nuzlocke. These segments were hell in that part. Uh, <laughs> mostly because, like... Sometimes you never knew what uh, your teammate was gonna have, and it could be a real shitty mon that, like, I, I want to say, I forget what what Cheryl had. I want to say it was pro it was something really freaking weak that like always went down super fast. Um, you know, even though it was a level twenty. Hi, Sad. Hey, Sing. How's it going? Um, I'm actually gonna switch Pokemon. Um, let's put out... I mean, like... I feel like UCA is... No, you UC... No. Bloons is the best option here. <laughs> Understandable. That sounds rough randomized. It's... It was really bad. I think in the Wayward Cave, I had... Mina had... Ma Mira? Mira. Mira had Masquerade. Oh, I forgot about his confusion. Whoops. Shit. Um, I can just run, can't I? Yes. <laughs> Let's just run. <laughs> we can do that with the with the with the fight, and I'm automatically healed. So this is also my favorite optional area of the game. Did you did you draft Rotom by any chance? No, I did not. I did not draft Rotom, unfortunately. So. I would've had I known that we would have access to all of its forms via cheats. Because Rotom is, is, uh, is, is, I love Rotom. Rotom is a great, great mon. Um, very sad that I didn't get it, but it's okay. Uh, if you're curious what I did draft, um, the, uh, list is, should be... Yeah, it's on the bottom of the screen. All the Pokemon that you see there are the ones that are on my draft on my list. So, did not did not get did not get my boy Rotom, sadly, but it's okay. All right, Rotom is is one of my top three Gen Four Pokemon, and hold a slot in my top ten Pokemon all time list. It's a good mon, like just all around good 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 thing. Really good, just really good, all around good boy. Oh, I don't want to. Here comes the swarm. Rotom and Miss Magius are like the only two Gen 4 mon I like, but I have a strong anti Gen 4 bias. Oh, rip. Zubzub can take on two bug types. I think it, I think I think he can do that. I know I put it out for like other Pokemon that I thought it could it could take, and then it got summarily whacked real hard. But you know, maybe this will be the time. Maybe Zubzub can finally show off its power. Maybe we'll see. <laughs> um, we'll go for Burmy. There we go. This time we'll be different, yes. <laughs> Hell yeah. Also, oh, I should do some things. First, let me give some shout outs to people. That's Devil Summoner Marie. That we want a shout out satellite. And also, Gardrak. Gardrak needs some money pretty urgently. So if you can, you, if you can, uh, 
give them some ch cash, that would be really a uh, boss of you. You should do it. It's a good cause. Because Gardrek really needs to make sure that they make rent. So, yeah, definitely, definitely do it. Finally, Zub Zub shines. It only took it until level 17, but we got there eventually. <laughs> Alright. Oh no! Hold on. No, 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 no! <sighs> Shit. <laughs> oh. It's not different at all, is it, Zub? No. Okay, uh, I'm gonna switch to UCA because I sense another confusion coming, and UCA uh, doesn't weak to psychic, so it should we should be okay. Or tackle, I mean that's fine too, but we're, we're okay. Meh. We'll do another. I mean. Dovey! Hello, Morgan! How you doing? Welcome on in. Woo! Level 19! Nice. Got a Cascoon. Okay. Whoa. Oh, wah, 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 wah. Oh. Is that Rin? Right there? Okay. Run from you. Potion. Nice. Ultra wide win. Amazing. Wide screen. <laughs> nice pun, I love it. <laughs> All right. Cody and Rachel. Psyduck and Meditate. Um, let's see. Um. Yeah, we're not gonna put out Zub Zub because of the psychic type. Ah, uh, ooh, but you're poison. The Metite psychic. Um. Man, I don't know who to put out. I mean, I guess Vor. Oh, but you're you're level 15, 17. Shit. Hey Dev, I believe you can cheese these battles into being two v one. Uh, how do you mean? Oh, I see what you're saying. Like, not run into the middle, but, like, speak to each one of them one-on-one. -on -one. Well, I mean, I could cheese them, but... As in, just got to go on ye. Yeah, we could, we could cheese it, yeah. Honestly, it might not be a bad idea, because I am kind of scared <laughs> of, of this. Um... Ah... Uh, fuck, I don't know. Who do I put out? Oh, wait! Or I could give you a quest to not cheese them. I, I mean, you could do that if you want to. <laughs> um. Alright, I think the safest bet right now is to keep Vor2 in because Vor2 is not weak to anything that this uh, team has, at least right now. Um. I'm gonna go for the Menatite. 
Maybe we should have a poll. I can draw up a poll if you want. Um... Okay, poll has been poll has been has been placed. Now I, I already voted f voted within my own head if we should have a poll, and I voted yes. So that step's already been taken care of. Wow. Oh, I'm confused. That's not good. <laughs> Woo, nice. Yikes. Oh, jeez. The sad part about Chansey is just, it's so slow, so it doesn't- oh my god. Alright, quick attack, let's freaking go. Don't hit yourself. Oh my god. <laughs> Yay! Good. Meditate's down. Oh, and I leveled up, nice. And the side for some reason keeps going after Chansey, that's fine by me. Okay, um... How much? Hmm. Uh. I don't know which of these moves does the most damage. P probably water gun because of stab. Wait, how are you cheesing them again? Um, I would, instead of walking in- basically, all the- for any double battles that I can not have be a double battle, I not have them be a double battle. So, instead of walking in between the trainers and challenging them both at the same time, I talk to each of them one-on-one -on -one and then only fight one Pokemon. That would be cheesing them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, <laughs> the, the crowd has spoken. So I guess it's up to you, Gardrick, if you want to take Chat's advice or be mercy, merciful, and not make my life harder. I mean, granted, I guess I am technically making my life harder by voluntarily going into this, but um, fuck. Do I stay in or do I keep trying to go after Psyduck here? Um. I could probably switch into Morgan and it would be fine. So yeah, let's do that. That's more votes than I expected. The people have spoken. I don't feel that it's in the spirit of developers intended. Oh, fuck! No, no, no. Oh, oh my god! My life flashed right before my eyes. Holy shit. Okay, please outspeed this Psyduck. God damn it. So, this is. I am playing with fire right now. But Mega Drain should help. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, whew. Oh my god, Chansey, why? I mean, some developers have said that they Nuzlocke. I mean, yeah. I almost. You know, not just just to not risk it even more. We're gonna go to Vormont. We're gonna do Psyduck v Psyduck. Cause God do I not wanna have to have Morgan die. I really want my Rose Raid. <laughs> um, I meant to say that they don't approve of Nuzlocks. What the heck happened? Uh let's go for scratch. Oh my god. Whew! Scary. Oh no, my meditate. Oh my goodness. Cool. Morgan is expendable. No, Morgan's not expendable. 
I Mor Morgan is very important to this whole endeavor here. Oh, ga ghastly! It's not nighttime. Why is ghastly out? Okay. I'm still gonna run though. Green shard. Neat. Morgan is irreplaceable. Agreed. I agree with the sentiment. Alright. Cool, so we made it through Turn of Forest. That's good. A couple of close calls, but uh, we did pretty well there. I honestly feel like it'd be easier for me to grind, like, without Cheryl, so that I can, like, better predict what I'm, like, face, you know, like, have an easier time with it. Um, however, now that I have my grind candies, I might not even really have to grind all that much, so. I should dub as lot to replace Morgan with another buddy if they die. Yes, I am. I am. So in that sense, I guess, but I, it's gonna be harder for me to get a Rose Ra Rosalia if I lose a buddy and have to get a new one. So... And that's why I'm kinda like, that's the thing with Zub Zub, like, I really wanna make sure I can get a Golbat, you know? Or Crobat, I mean. It's gonna be way harder to get a Gro Col Crobat otherwise. If she dies, we will rebuild her stronger, faster, cuter? <laughs> Impossible. Hi, Austinus, how you doing? Hope you're doing well. Man, I can't. Uh, I feel like horde battles in Gen 6 would have been better if you couldn't throw a po could have thrown a Pokeball without knocking out all Pokemon. Hi, Hoi Dove. Hi, Osto. Morgan's your electric boogaloo! <laughs> Indeed. Alright, so now we're on the other half of Route 205. This is Route, Route 205 Part... Part do. Um, okay. Should I just I'm kinda con I'm kinda thinking about uh just quickly skipping this route mostly and then going directly to Turner City to get myself get myself Togepi. Because Togepi is in Eternity City. You get her from you get it from um Cynthia, so I'm thinking I'm thinking we, we just we just go ahead and uh and do that. I don't think there's anything I can catch here. Oh, we should get the berries though. I ran into so many shiny Pokemon that I did nothing about when I had Gen 6. I just KO'd them. No! Yeah, it especially sucks because of how common you'd get more than one shiny if you do a tunnel. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. You all make a very good point. You all make very good points. I was like, I can't catch some- oh well, KO time. Yeah. I guess it, it do be like that sometimes. Bidoof. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna just skip over this route and for now. Well, I can at least put Slower on some honey. Um, cause I'm pretty sure there's something in the grass I can get. No, healing thing would be Buizel, but I can't do that right now. So, yeah. And I can't get anything fishing either. Oh, I need to make sure I keep that in mind for fishing. Um, mm -hmm. but I, don't, I don't think there's anything fishing-wise. Yeah, no. I think my big fishing encounter is Remoraid. Am I right? Yeah, Remoraid's like my big fishing encounter, so that's not until later in the game. So we don't have to worry about fishing for a while. So most of- so Gen 2 of- so Route 205 is gonna be potential Heracross. 
Oh, I don't have any more honey. No, I have to go back to Flora Meadow and get honey. Damn it. <laughs> oh, unfortunate. It wasn't later until I learned that you could KO four of them to catch one. Ah. Uh, big. In quotes. Okay. Alright, so. We're gonna head over to get... Um, I don't know when I get it. I get the thing from Cynthia. I don't know at what what point if she comes like about as soon as we get at, get there. I feel like she like basically as soon as you arrive, she's like, "Hey, how you doing? By the way, have this egg, <laughs> or have this thing that looks like an egg." Um, I'm pretty sure anyway. Let me one. Let me figure this out. Can I offer you an egg in these shines? <laughs> that, that, that really is, that really is the idea. Okay, hold on, I'm looking at the walkthrough. Eterna City. Hold on. Oh, Eterna City, Eterna Gym. Herb shop, bike shop. Okay, so the first, the really only thing we can do right now is challenge the gym. Um, and then there's the Galactic Building. Togepi, okay, I get Togepi after... After I go to, um... So I get to, I get the egg after I encounter, after the, after I beat, like right before I get the bike. So we still have time. Um, what level do I need to be before I do, let's see, where the, what's the average on the trainers at the very least? Okay, average on the trainers is almost 17, but like 16-ish. I feel like we're over that. I did buy. Yeah, we're, we're definitely good enough to challenge at least the trainers in the gym. Um. Okay, so. We can't get Togepi quite yet, so I feel like we might as well just go ahead and beat all the trainers on this route to level ourselves up a bit more. Um, yeah, all these water, all these, uh, all these boys. <laughs> oh. Hello, I've been playing the Steam version of Vookie Clicker. Oh, Cookie Clicker, and I really should know how to make the mod because I had a really good idea for some one. Ah, the Cookie Clicker. Why are you on the Steam? Isn't that like a free web app? This Cookie Clicker. Uh, maybe it doesn't work anymore because of Fla Flash might have died. Flash's death might have affected it. I don't actually know. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So for uh, we want to focus on. For for the grass gym, we want to focus on Zub Zub, and we want to focus on balloons. Those are gonna be our our big boys for for this particular part of the of the game. Just learn modding. Not to get your source fine. Oh, okay, that's good. Cookie Clicker is such an interesting game. I played it a couple times. 
it's such a weird game because it's like kind of passive ish i don't know it's so interesting or maybe maybe works fine again whichever oh okay Whew, that horn, horn attack is pretty powerful come on morgan oh my goodness oh no okay water pulse Jesus. Okay. Wow. I guess Morgan can't even take out a Goldeen. Cool. Um. I'll put out uh, Vormon. Scream. Scrims. I am back. Very sog. You're good. Everything that gives money through adds the, the total legacy CPS. What? Eventually you get a legacy upgrade, I think it's called. Oh, okay. I see. Hey, what? Did someone see something? Every oh, everything that gives money, though, adds the total, adds- Yes, yeah, your example of genre called underground games are possibly unflattering idol games. Yes. I mean- I mean, to be honest, the, the like- like- I'm not saying- I'm not- I, when I was describing it being a passive experience, that wasn't necessarily a criticism of it. Like, that's just what it is. It's, it's not- it doesn't require your constant attention, you know what I mean? Like- you can kind of just let it run in the background, check up on it, and then, you know, buy upgrades or whatever, and then keep it going, and then continue to buy upgrades. You know what I mean? Oh, you were saying that Morgan can't hit That was what you are angry at. You are angry at the fact that- uh, Well, look, maybe if my trainer was better, I would have evolved by now. What the fuck? Hey! Oh. Oh, whoops. Can you guys still hear me? Sorry, I, like, flipped over the mic on my- Okay, I think- I think we're okay. Shade. Thoughts I made an excellent video about it. Morgan the Shady. <laughs> we hear you. What was that, Tom? I can't hear you. Guys, come on. I'm sure if I- if I said something lurid and hot, y'all would, like, immediately stop pretending and be like, I'm listening. <laughs> At least, you know, some of you would. I don't know if everybody is the same level of horny in this chat, but... Okay, um... I'm ace, so this doesn't affect me. <clears throat> Mommy milkers. What, I can hear you say something hornier. I just did. Um, quick attack. Alright, well, I mean, these are magic carps, so we don't need to change. Well, that's getting clipped. It's already- me saying the meme was, has already been clipped, though. Like, that's the whole point. I mean, I know I was- I said it close and I typically do that. I, I typically say my- I typically say the meme, excuse me, I almost slipped there. Um, into the mic. <laughs> like, directly into it. I'm very used to the music in Eterna City because as a kid I didn't get type combinations, so because I chose Kavok, I kept losing! <laughs> ah! It's alright. I That was how I was when I was playing, um, Gen 2. Uh, I did I did not understand that beating, trying to beat a Spearow with a Pidgey wasn't really gonna work out in my favor, so... Thank you. I clipped it because it was a really good one. Thanks, Morgan. I appreciate it. <laughs> As always, you can put uh, your clips in the clip library in the Discord. Um. Oh. <laughs> I don't think I put the last clip in, in one of the Discords that has clips in it. Um. Even though that clip is something I am, uh, kind of- I mean, it was one of the best moments. It was one of the best, like, weird things I've ever said on stream, kind of. 
It was it was a pretty transcendental ex transcendental time. Uh, we want clips. Thank you also, Gardrek, for the clip. Um. Sorry, guys. I'm just gonna take care of this really quick. Before I forget. Oh, excuse me. Before I forget. Um. Want to know the origin? <laughs> Can't you just go? <laughs> I mean, but like that, that would, I don't think people would like spend any channel points if, if all I did was just repeat the meme, like, or just redirected to the, uh, to the first clip. Totally, I totally forgot about that clip. <laughs> Thank you, chat, for dredging up the weird shit. Really appreciate it. None of our other hashtag channel lore has had the staying power of, <laughs> of the meme. I guess not. Well, I mean, Vormon has has had has a legacy. Vormon has is very strong legacy. Although, both of those things predate this particular channel, so... I, I gotta start- I gotta start making some better jokes. Or have some better, like, channel lore for, like, this particular channel. I think that would be a good idea. Uh, just, just get fun- <laughs> JUST GET FUNNIER! Wow. As I've said this before, but I've wanted Twitch affiliate so I can have redeems where it plays an audio clip with a catchphrase of my favorite streamer friends. Guess which one is gonna be tough? <sighs> Do I dare ask? I feel like I won't be surprised. I'll be just disappointed. <laughs> oh, Alright, that's not a thing here. <laughs> Damn, I forgot how good Dove sang that. Oh my god. <laughs> If there's one thing that I'm good at, it's kind of good at. I, I have a okay singing voice. I'm not terrible. I should sing more. Um, do I dare have a... I, w would you guys be interested in a redeem where, like, you guys have me sing a song? <laughs> Such is the life of a funny, they like they like me. Ostomus is funnier than me, and I hate them for it! You're voicing with- Oh, really? Thank you! I- I don't have any good concept of how good my singing voice is. Uh... I'll bring you out. But I'm biased. <laughs> I mean, if people want to see me sing, then that is a clip of me singing. I'm better at singing when, like, I have background music. It's harder for me to sing when I have to do it, like, on my own. Unless it's a song I know super, super well. Like, like Christmas Caroling, for instance. I did that, uh, when I was younger. Um. I was almost a professional singer. Ooh, really? That's cool. What kind of songs were you thinking? What kind of genre were you thinking of being a singer for? Like, ooh, crit. That's nice.
Oh wait, I get the deep lore of Dove's old channel name now? Neat, yes, yes. Um, I mean, the, the old channel is still active. And I do still have the VODs from it if you wanted to, like, look at it. Um, I'm not ashamed of that past at all. It's just, things change and you gotta rebrand sometimes. Um, let me... I believe... I think I have uploaded everything that I had in my archives from that channel. So... If you, if you wanted to, uh... Watch some of my older videos, there you go. Um, I need to actually add metadata to most of them, but, um... D there you go. <laughs> They're all there. All the some of the a lot of the old channel lore um, is from this channel. So if you ever were lost and you don't know a reference, that's that. There's where the reference is. Looks at old channel name. It was Sindarin Elvish. Oh <laughs> man, it literally was. Ju okay, the old channel name was literally just a combo of my username and Soundjack's username in gaming. It was not a very creative name. Um, <laughs> I feel like Rational Dove is a little better. Um, it's just a little more unique and memorable and less of a mouthful. Yeah. Okay, ooh. Actually, there's a friendship checker I can get from You can learn about- Oh yeah, the Lucario Massacre! Oh, I can- I can actually- Um... That's also a clip, too. That was a bullsh- that was some bullshit. That freaking that freaking Lucario still haunts my dreams. <laughs> um, hold on. I have to- I still have more followers on my old channel than my new one. And here is the... Oh, whoops. Sorry, guys. There's a... Huh? Soundtrack hasn't streamed on it since you left. I hope it's doing okay. Uh, so Soundtrack and I have mutually agreed to sort of let the channel be an archive. Neither of us are probably going to stream on that ever again. I mean, maybe we might. Uh, I think Soundtrack is thinking about uh, streaming on his own. In the I don't actually know. I, hold on, I can text him. I have him on stream here for you guys if you guys wanted to say hi to him. I think he's... Oh, he might not be home yet, but... Um, uh, it was worse because Soundtrack was almost never there. Except in the background spoiling the game! Wow! That's woof! Those are some, those are some words there. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Soundtrack is famously bad at, uh, at, uh, not spoiling things for people. Um, I, I literally... Um, I literally, like, have had to tell him sometimes, like, he can't talk to me about certain new things that are releasing, because I'm like, I just don't want to know. Like, whenever there's a new Pokemon release... He's like, oh, so I heard leaks, and I'm like, I don't, I don't want to hear it. I don't, I don't even want to. I'm like, even if someone would be like, oh, but like, I don't think they're real. I'm like, I still want to know. <laughs> like, just don't tell me. I'm not. I don't need to know. So, I think it's just because he's the kind of person who likes to share things with people, and really likes to just share what he, what, what he gets excited about, and for that reason, um, yeah, that's just kind of his. His whole thing um so I, I don't blame him for that it's just you know um oh i'm glad he's not going to use that channel more either that seemed unfair to me to have him inherit the followers he built up yeah we we were we um i let him stream on that just for the time being but yeah no i i want i think we're gonna just leave it as an archive just because it's i feel like it's better 
and then we can both like kind of have our own Twitch followings, and I think that's better. And like, I'm also I think in the future I will definitely collaborate with Soundjack on some streams. Like, I don't mind having him as a guest or for us to do like a cooperative thing in the future. I just don't want us to be like tied together as an internet unit anymore. You know, that's that's the real reason why I why we uh, decided not to continue the. Uh, the legacy of RDSJ gaming. It's it's better in the past. It's better in the past. Anyway, I was gonna text Soundjack. Hold on. Let me get him, his name up here. Also, um, uh, yeah, I get it. I gotta keep your own personal hobby special to you. Exactly. Yeah, that's the, that's the big thing. Also, um, Soundjack does still have some YouTube endeavors that he's doing. So if you guys want to still check him out and see what he's up to, um, That would be really cool. He actually just recently, um, oh man, this, this freaking introductory channel is so old. It's like five years old. <laughs> um, one thing that I'm kind of sad about is the playthrough of Gale of Darkness is probably never gonna, pro yeah, I mean, like, I, I, I would be fine. I don't know how I would feel about, I guess Soundtrack and I could still finish that off on. RDSG gaming, but I also feel like I've, I don't, I don't know if I want to like finish up anything that's on RDSG gaming. <laughs> I, I'd be, I'd be totally fine with like restarting a playthrough of, of Gale of Darkness, but on my own time, like as a new playthrough on the channel, I'd be up for that. I just don't know if I'd want to finish up the one that I started already. Yeah. But yeah, so that's his YouTube channel. It's mostly Transformers reviews, so if that sounds like your interest, then feel free to check it out. And then there's this other channel. He's changed. I forget what it's called now. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I prefer doing your own XC playthrough too, but not right this minute. Yeah, that would be kind. And then this is his uh his lesser known channel that is his more like story time theorizing kind of more standard vlog kind of stuff um that one i know he's i think i honestly i mean i think he still does care about sound jack but from how he's been talking i think th this one michael blaine stage is more his real passion project at the moment so um you know if so if those if that stuff seems interesting to you feel free to give him a follow and or subscribe to his channel and uh you know, check it out. Um, yeah. He hasn't released anything in quite a while. Um, but I know he's been working on trying to get back into the swing of things. So, he might have a release out sooner rather than later. But yeah. Anyway. Back to this game. <laughs> enough of- enough of what I was- I've been up to in the past. Um... Okay, so I beat all the trainers over there. Oh, I did I get the friendship checker from this girl? Or did I just go into the- did I just heal and then I not talk to anyone? Okay, there we go. Every time I see Pokemon say XD, I always know the XD and see this in Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. Okay, alright. Let's see how our friendship is. Okay. Okay, we got we got one heart on on Badu. Yep. Okay, everybody has one heart. It's not Pokemon Stadium though. 
What is? What's that Pokemon Stadium? I don't know. I'm not a nerd like you. It's just Pokemon Redacted Gale of Darkness. <laughs> Alright, um... Let's keep getting items, and then we will... Platinum. Okay, I think Soundjack might actually be home now. I think I heard the door close, so. Assuming he read my text. Oops, no. Turn a city. I'm trying to get my item. Good card. Super potion. Okay, I won't get cut yet. Cars cut. Oh yeah, the underground man. We might as well get the underground kit. I I mean I won't need it to get spirit tomb, but um I will need it to if I want to get heart skills to learn a move or something. That would be like the biggest benefit of having the explore kit. Oh, whoops, I forgot there's a whole tutorial thing. Giant mouse cursor, oh sorry, sorry. Um, Draco Clate. Oh yeah, there's that cool statue. I really, oh shit. Oh, okay, I was like, please don't challenge you to a battle. I don't know if I'm ready yet. Dawn has become a mouse. Oh shit. Oh, hi! Uh, so Soundtrack's here, everybody. So for those of you who are asking uh, or for him, here he is. Hello, guys. Yep. It was funny. I, I You probably didn't even know I was out. Uh, I mean, I, I was... At first, I didn't know. I, I was thinking... No, I, when I texted you, I, I remember that it was Wednesday, which was garbage day. So I just figured I'd text you so that once you came back, you were... Well, yeah, garbage day, but I would have been done by now. I went out to Target. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, you are a little late, but that's okay. Yeah, because um, <laughs> no store carries orange Gatorade around here except Target. Hmm, for whatever okay. reason. And also street day for the new Transformers toy related to the film toys. <laughs> gotcha. So it was like a big day for you. <laughs> yes. Okay, uh, yeah, we got, uh, Panda and Morgan are saying hello. Garjack hello. said, Soundtrack's here to spoil the game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm glad the mark I left is that I'm a horrible backseat gamer. <laughs> <laughs> Toys, lol. Yeah. I always really like this statue, because it does look like both... Yeah, it does Palkia, look both. Yeah. Does look like both Yaga and Palkia. I never saw it as a kid, but after seeing it as an adult, it makes sense. Yeah. I always thought it was just the Alga. Where is? Hold on, is it? Oh, right thank here? you, Morgan. <laughs> we give you a hard time out of love. Very <laughs> right, cool. Got Draco Plate. Um, yeah, so I promoted your channel stuff, but if since you're here, um, would you want to? Um, you know, talk about uh, uh, yeah. Your your any updates on that? It's clearly the origin form. <laughs> Not me. I'm just a dick. <laughs> well, um, yeah. So my intent was to get back to my channels during this year, during this at the start of the year, and then uh, I didn't get done much done in January. But I was still working on stuff. And February came around and holy hell, work hit me like a truck. Like, Alyssa knows, mm -hmm. I'm not gonna go into further detail, but like, work is, uh, it's all, I'm also working at a tax office, so tax season also really sucks. Yeah. So probably nothing until after that is done, which is April 15th. Um, because I still don't even have a top 
the top Transformers of 2022 video out on my review channel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So that will be uh, a bit overdue. Um, mm. But I'll have that, then I'll have a video explaining uh, in a bit detail of why I didn't really do any videos last year on my stuff, which you guys should know, jaw surgery, all that fun stuff. Um, and then I'm gonna get, I got, definitely got ideas for videos. And I'm honestly been considering to start streaming on Twitch a little bit. So, I have a lot of big promises. <laughs> oh wait, I forgot I have a Soothe Bell. I should use that, especially on the two oh. Pokemon that like need friendship to evolve. <laughs> that would be a good idea. Yeah. I guess I'll put on Subzip for now. But yeah, so so that's what's been going on, on my end. Well, um, thank you for uh, for giving us the lowdown. Yeah. Um. Back to you in the studio. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See ya. See ya! Yeah, if you could. That would be... What did you get? Um... I got... This Cheetor, which turns into a sword instead of a robot for some reason. Fun. And this third pack, which includes the infamous Wheeljack design. Oh, the one with the glasses on it? Yeah, the Steve Urkel one. Nice. That... People in the fan are like, that's not even Wheeljack, that's a different character. And they're like, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Actually, his name was, uh, he told me about you. <laughs> sounds like Gar, it sounds like Gardena is trying to like, save face for the fact that she totally missed what his name was. And was just like, I don't remember, but like, it's okay, it doesn't matter. <laughs> All right. Um, so yeah, so that I guess for those of you, because I think there are a couple people who are watching right now who um, did not watch Soundjack in the past or watch me on RDSJ Gaming in the past. So that was Soundjack for those of you who don't know. I love that we named him. Oh, uh, I know. Good day, nerds. Good day, banana. How you doing? I hope you're doing well. Okay, so we're gonna challenge all the trainers in here, uh, just to like get my levels up a little bit more before the before the battle. Um, I think we're gonna focus on having Zub Zub and Bloons as like the main people fighting. I tried to have an early night and get to sleep at 10 p.m. I've already been to sleep. It's been midnight now. Yeah, I was gonna ask. You don't tend to show up in my like later, my my later night streams because it's pretty late where you are, I would imagine. So uh, sorry that you're uh that you're having trouble sleeping. That sucks. Who are you calling a nerd, nerd? <laughs> I'm not! We're all nerds here, I'm not. <laughs> uh, Panda is willing to fight for their honor. <laughs> oh no. Ostomus and Panda are having some words. I've been put to sleep- I, I have been to sleep. Uh, one. Or I, but for some godforsaken reason, I decided to wake up after two hours. Oh, that's even worse. I'm sorry. That sucks. Well, I'm hopeful. Hopefully, um, I can help you fall asleep. I'll try and be super boring. Um, let me see. Some boring subjects. Why is the first thing that came to my mind mayonnaise? I, I don't. I don't think mayonnaise is a particularly boring subject necessarily. 
Oh no, Morgan! No! Meet me up behind the bike racks! <laughs> oh my gosh. The boring subject is making tunnels. I think you must have called uh, Panda a nerd. Did you kill me? No, no, you're you're still alive. Don't worry, don't worry. You're still you're still very much kicking. I gotta go heal though. What are? Okay, level caps twenty two on Gardenia. So I gotta get my average up to level twenty one. Did Morgan say something lewd? I, no. I don't know what did happen more- Oh! Oh no, what happened, Morgan? Boobies? Nah, nah. I think- I think- I think Morgan only gets banned whenever she calls Panda a nerd. So. <laughs> that is, uh, Panda's berserk button, as TV tropes would call it. That's my way of flirting with Morgan Alamea! <laughs> Weird, on my end it looks like I'm not banned. That is kind of weird, isn't it? <laughs> I just- oh, you just deleted the message. Oh, okay. I must have misread the- uh, the text that was explaining what happened. Oh, I can still see it. Okay. Panda is a nerd, so can I? Badu. Oh shit! Happen once again. <laughs> Cheeky time out there. Oh, come on. Come on, Zub Zub. It's just a buddy. You can do this. There we go. Badu. Morgan, it's been seven seconds, you can talk again. There you are. <laughs> Alright. Thank you for the rins. <laughs> Wide rin judges now. Judges you. Excuse me. Let it judge me all at once. Oh, chat, so funny. So fucking mad about Brilliant Gem and Shining Pearl. Yeah. It was a, uh, I have forehead Garfield judging you. Oh damn, Garfield, Garfield judging your sins? That's pretty harsh.
Nice. Woo! All right, so now it's just the gym leader. Um, I'm probably going to. Well, hold on, I'll wait for the fountains to go down. So I'm gonna go heal, and we're probably gonna do. Gonna use some uh, rare candies to make this a little easier. Unless people want me to grind, which we could. Um, I'll leave it to a poll. So the other option here would be for me to grind my way to level 21 average. Our option for the pull up to dove. Sorry for not seeing that until the pull was already up. Alright. Looks like one vote we have for yes, I should use rare candies. Yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't level anybody up beyond level cap. Uh, I'd probably just get everybody up to like level 21-ish. And then that would be where we would um stop. You can use rare candies, but you'll miss out on the EVs. My vote is for up to you. That is true, I would miss out all miss out on the EVs. <clears throat> so that could make my my team weaker to some extent. Um, while you guys are waiting, I will do some grinding in the grass. Oh, jeez. Damn. That is some fast-forwarded music. Let me, uh, lower it. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're going to turn on this music. Oh, that's loud. Hello. Okay. <laughs> Hey, hey, banana, you're a cutie. Let me know if you guys are gonna, uh... Ooh, flame wheel! Yes! Let's get rid of Ember. Flame wheel's really good. Um... Oh, fuck. You know what? Never mind. <laughs> Jesus. <gasps> fuck! Holy shit. None of these- none of the Pokemon I'm choosing for my grinding are- are- are what we need. <laughs> Only one person voted. Does anybody have, like, any, um... Other opinions? Did we just not see the poll? Let me know. Or was it like a we want you to decide kind of deal? Oh fuck, I didn't mean to do that. Oh my god. There we go. <laughs> not gonna lie, I'm not playing attention at all. I vote turn off speed up. Oh, okay. I mean, I'm turning- I have the speed up on just so that, like, I- Grinding doesn't take forever. Because otherwise it'll take forever.
That's okay if you're not paying attention. You don't have to be paying attention. How about I, um... What I'll do is I'll get... Um... Some of them... Chat type 1 if you want rare candies, type 2 if you want grinding. There you go, that's a good way to do it. Um... There we go. Formon wants confusion. Ooh, um... Let's give it a tail whip. Alright, so actually I'm gonna- I'll do this one more last battle, and then I'm going to go on my midstream break, so... And we'll be back after that moment. Ooh, shit. Not cool. Oh my god. All right, we're paused. Okay, so I'll be back in a moment. Um, see you guys in a bit.
everybody, welcome back. I am back. Thank you. Okay. Um, so. Back to grinding. Or did we uh, make a... Did we make any other decisions? Did most people want me to just use the... Back to grinder, did you say? Grinding! Oh, okay. Pe do people want me to spam rare candies then? I see, okay. In that case. Um, let's see. Alright. Nope. Alright, we're normal speed now. All right. All right, so let's elevate the boys then. Okay. Okay. And then we're gonna get to 21. And that's where we'll be where we, uh, where we stop. Ooh, yes! We want Aqua Jet on board too. As opposed to Water Gun. Aqua Jet's way better. Okay. And then I'll throw Kennedy on Morgan. Let me actually remind myself how to raise friendship in... In, in Gen 4. Okay, so... The massage... Let me give our boy a massage. That's in uh, Vilsun Steady. So not the out yet. <coughs> Excuse me. Actually, uh So yeah, there's that. Oh, actually, interesting. Learning a TM or HM improves friendship. I didn't know that. Huh. Okay. Um. As well as using vitamin. Confuse Ray. Confuse Ray is good. 
Oh, I feel like that's better. I feel like it's super smart. That's like 100% accurate. Oh, okay. Alright. So now. So it's 20 plus 20 plus 22. So it's 20.6667. Okay. Might have been better for me to have left a couple Pokemon at level 20, but that's fine. That's nah, fine. We'll be fine. I don't think we're over level for this fight at all. So. No, we're actually going to put, put Zub first. And balloons is the lead up. Now the one thing we're gonna Yeah, okay. Balloons is gonna be a little Yeah. Okay. It's 7.35. We're about to get get we're get guests. What the fuck are these people thinking? That's pretty late for guests. Yeah. All right. Let me see. Let me save. Save complete. Okay. Let us do our normal, no, not that. Our prediction. Feel free to, uh, to bet on if I lose them on or not. We shall see. So far we've been pretty lucky, but, uh, you know, it could still go pretty south anytime, so. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Let us begin. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. Stretching. All right, we're starting with her twig. We attack, go. Nice. Ah, okay, we're setting up our defenses here. I see. I am betting against my better judgment. Ooh, okay. That's a lot of a lot of points to bet. Alright, we're gonna keep battling. We're doing pretty good so far. I threw in 10 just because. <laughs> yeah, if you wanna. Oh, damn. Wow, Cherim did not really give a single shit about uh, Zubza's wing attack there. Damn. Really not giving much of a set of shit. The, that way people feel like they're getting something. <laughs> and they're wrong, I get 3.2k points, indeed. As a question, is anybody close to redeeming the 100,000 channel points thing of choosing my next game? I'm curious. 41- oh, 47.1, that's pretty good. 
All right. Rose Raid, the big, the big kahuna. Um, because it's Rose Raid, I'm actually going to switch to Bloons for that extra base power. Because I, I don't know. I don't know if I trust Zub Zub to be able to handle a Rose Raid. Ah. Uh, Oh, oh, 74.1k? Sorry, I must have just read that. I, I'm bad with numbers. Oh, of course, there's a sun stun spore. Lovely. Oh, great. Good, good shit, good shit. It's okay, lol. Oh, I missed it. I have uh, 24k. Ah. Woo! Damn, balloons! Look at you go! That's a six? <sighs> that, that actually did quite a lot of damage, that magical leaf. But we're good! We're good! Woo! That was pretty easy! Nice! Woo! Yeah, thank you. Might said before, but you're really tough. Thank you. Yay! I did it! <laughs> Alright, so we're going to... Um... Yay! TM86. That's good. Yay for Grass Knot. Alright, let me... All right. Dove, do you have a dis do you have dyscalculia? I think I do. It's never been diagnosed or anything, but I, I feel like I probably have dyscalculia, which might be explain why math has been such a huge struggle for me all my life. Yeah, yeah, Dove. Thank you, Duncan. Also, welcome on in. How you doing? How have you been? What's you been up to? Let me know. Okay, I won't make fun of you anymore! What did- Okay, well, I appreciate that. Yay, monies! You got ten- you got ten nice channel points there. Okay, so Gardenia is behind us, so now, um, we are going to go and, uh... Let's see, Mar... Still haven't- okay. So Jupiter is our next- our next locale. Now that we have Cut. Oh, we gotta figure out who to teach Cut to. Um... Man, who do we give tut Cut to, you guys? Our option- our options are Morgan or Bloons. We'll, we'll do a vote on that one, because I have no idea. I mean, I, I'm honestly feeling like Morgan would be the best option, but, uh... I make this only a one minute, Paul. Alright, I've set up a vote. Dove is lovely and charming. Thank you, Morgan. I appreciate it. Enjoy the 10 points. Everyone wants a question? Oh, yeah. Which mom should get cut? I don't know which one I should give it to. <laughs> Morgan or Bloons? Cut is equally shitty, so don't either one of them. So, <laughs> it's like, I don't know. I feel like Morgan would be the best answer, but that's just me. I'm, I'm hoping to eventually um, go to the, like, move deleter and get rid of the HMs since I don't need them anymore. Sorry, Morgan, but Rock Climb is better on Informate than Cut. And you're expendable! <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, I would also agree that that uh, that that uh, Rock Climb is better on Informate than Cut, because Rock Climb is just a better move in general. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> oh, good stuff. How dare! <laughs> Alright! 
So Morgan, 80 BP and a flinch chance, great move. No, it's it's a good move. Rock climb is, is indeed a nice, a good move. I agree. Oh, hold on. I fucked up. Use, yep, I want to teach it to Morgan. Yes, which move should we remove? Uh, worry seed. <laughs> worry seed is less useful than the other ones. All right, cool. Cut has been learned. Um, cool, okay, so. Actually, before I forget, I'm gonna Is this a no. Wanna rephrase that? I won't take that from a fucking weeb nerb. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna go oh, we can't slather honey until I buy from the honey salesman. No. That sucks. At least get these berries while I'm here. I mean, the honey salesman's actually not too far away, so why don't we just go and get honey, and then I'll put honey on the trees that we need honey on, and then, um, yeah. And then I'll get silver powder that's here, and the sleep talk that's here. Just make it try. Got all the items. Oh yeah, fashion accessory. Thank you. Yep. So there's a there's a honey tree there that we have to. What fruit is your own berry based on oranges? Yes. I think it even looks like an orange too. Oops, wrong button. Um. Like cherries based on cherry chesto. I forget which one Chesto is based off. It might just be Chestnut. Or, yeah, Oran looks like an orange. Raz is obviously raspberry. Blue is a blueberry. Or, well, I don't know if it's really a blueberry. No, it's not a blueberry. Blueberries don't look like that. It's probably a blackberry, honestly. Oran berry is a blueberry, isn't it? Um, I guess it I guess it kind of looks like a blueberry. But blueberries don't have that, like, mottled skin that oranges do, so that's why I think it's, like, an orange. Dove is confusing me! Why is it blue, then? I mean, why- I, I don't know. I mean, what other what other fruit would it be best based on? The fruits tend to be named after the fruit that they're based on. I mean, banana uh, the b b banana berries are like not yellow; they're what like pink in color. Oh, Pecha berries are peaches. I'm not trying to confuse anybody. Asper berries, I'm not sure on. I have no idea, honestly. Maybe pear? Probably pears. It has pear in its name, so I imagine it's pear. Even the article gives it a question mark. <laughs> oh. Let's buy ten. We gotta. We're gonna need them. <laughs> Thank you.
Oh, wait, hold on. I needed to... Asian pear, ass pear. Oh my- Oh! Ha, ah, I see. It does make a lot of sense. Amazing. That's pretty great. Alright. Alright, so that's been slathered. Now we go up to turn a forest. Um, nope. Bark slathered and honey. So, so all three of those trees have been slathered, so I have time tomorrow to um, check up on them and see how they are. Alright, so with that out of the way, turn of building is next. Um... We're gonna get Thief. Make sure I get all the items. Oh, this is Surf. Okay. Oh my god, it makes- it does make a lot of sense, doesn't it? the highest on juniper oh okay 23 um so her average is 22 but i feel like the grunts might get us to that average she does have a level 23 stunt tank which could be super super scary hopefully i'll be able to get um like uca up more and that should take care of it because now I have magnitude so that should help uh, where are you um, no I want Whoa. Um, okay so let's see what the average is here Seventeen point two. We are definitely past that. So, I think fighting all the, through all the trainers in there should put us on par with what where we need to be for um for Jupiter. So, give me Barry, and I will tell you what it's based off of. Sure. Oh, it's Looker. That's right. Are you just reading Bulbapedia? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Mm. 
These are not the right Pokemon for this. <laughs> um, we're gonna put Vormon and uh, UCA. Ooh. Confusion. Rock throw. Nice. I can't use magnitude in a double battle, so uh, we're gonna keep using rock throw on Stunky. Oh, neat. Good. Glamio. We're gonna put out uh, balloons for this. Gonna keep UCI in, still throw a rock throw. Um, well, what about the blueberry? Is it based on a blackberry? I feel like it's based on a blackberry, not a blueberry. Because blueberries are not uh, shaped like the blueberry, they're shaped more um, circular. <laughs> I know Rost berries are based on strawberries, I'm pretty sure. Nice. Woo! Level 22 on balloons, good. Uh, poison. Not great. Oh yeah, blackberries. Yeah, that's what I thought. The Leppa berry is an apple, which makes a lot of sense while I was reading that. Yes, Leppa apple. Mm hmm That checks out. It's blue. What is, uh, bluke? Because it's the inverse of orange. Oh! LMAO! That's pretty funny. Okay, Krogunk. Uh. Woo! Nice crit! Zub Zub, good on you! You one shot at a crow gun. I'm proud. I'm so proud. Damn, nice. <laughs> that's a rare. That's a rare moment. Like speed. Did you just say LMAO? I did. Yes. I'm sorry. I know. I'm cringe. What can I say? I'm. I'm a very cringe person at heart. You all thought that I was cool, but instead I'm just pure cringe. Okay, that's the way forward, so let's go this way. Um, how do you say it? I don't. Okay. She doesn't fight me. B 
be the cringe you want to see in the world. Very fair. Very fair. Stun key. Mm-hmm. Sub sub. Um okay, this though this we can bring out uh UCA for. Oh, cool. I love it when they do that. I love it. I love it. I say LaMau! I'm like, I'm okay with it. Just caught me off guard. Oh my gosh. That's how I would say it if I were to say it out loud. Please hit the goddamn stunky. I'm begging you. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> get wrecked, Stunky. It's my magnitude ten. Nice. Subs are level twenty-two. Lovely. Not so lovely that I get hurt by poison, though. Uh, we're gonna switch. Uh, I guess sub up is my best option here. Right, well, I guess I could use Vormon with um, psych with confusion. That'll be times two. So times two, nice. Play meow. We're gonna switch to balloons. Cool. <gasps> Yay! Sub Sub's evolving! Woo! We get ourselves a nice. a nice uh, gold bat. Lovely. Yes! Good job, Sub Sub. Gold bat does his own pog, so I won't pog. <laughs> Alright, let me heal. There we go. Oh, gold bat instead of gold bat. <laughs> Nice. Good. All right. Gonna keep going up. mission is yep I'm aware of your mission King Galactic although <sighs> to Kadabra okay uh I actually don't really have a lot for Kadabra um hmm Zub Zub technically has moves that will counteract Kadabra but um Man, I have a huge weakness to Psychic on my team. 
Uh, I'm gonna go for Vor 2. I think Aqua Jet will do a lot to it. Oh! Quick! Oh, I should've used Pursuit. That's okay. Oh, please don't- <gasps> Oh my god! No! Vor 2! Oh no! Oh, that's not good. No, Vor 2, why? You were so young! Oh my god, please don't- please don't TPK this- Oh no. Um. Um. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Let me think. Let me think. Okay, we need to outspeed this bitch. Fastest. Zub Zub, technically not the fastest. Um. Fastest out of the. Okay. I, I- no, I did not! I did not do it on purpose! My first thought was like, okay, Vormon is also not weak to Psychic, so... And I, I- I- don't know, I don't know what my thought was. Okay, okay, you said- here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing, right. So- so, let's- like I said, we're- we're- we're working through this, okay? So... Um, so, Vorm, uh, UCA has shit for special defense, and is pretty slow, so I don't think we should send it in. That would be a bad idea. Morgan cute? No, it's not gonna outspeed the Kadabra and it's weak to Psychic. Zub Zub might outspeed a Kadabra, because it's fast, but, and I, I have- I do have- I should have used Pursuit, that was my first mistake. Um... I have... Send up Morgan for science. <laughs> Zub out- You think Dubs- You think Zub will outspeed a Kadabra? Here's the thing, will it outspeed a Kadabra? Cause if it does, I do have Bite, which will take it out. It will take out the Kadabra. Poison, does it have a poison move? Zub Zub, no. Zub Zub does not have a poison move, it's- it's moveset's kind of crap. It has bite though, which I feel like even without the stab we'll get the Kadabra because Kadabra's squishy. So I think think that'll be fine. The question is, will it outspeed a Kadabra? I don't know. I don't know what if it will or not. Um, other option is balloons. Now, here's the thing. Um, it is technically faster than my goal bat. Obviously, if 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 either if if either Zub Zub if Zub Zub gets sent out and it doesn't work out it's dead because Kadabra Kadabra's confusion will kill it. Um, Bloons has Mock Punch, which is priority. It will attack first regardless of speed. Which um, the question is now. I think does Kadabra resist? Does it resist? It might resist. I don't remember. Yes, okay, it does resist fighting. So I don't know if it would kill outright. So I'd be banking on stab, high attack, and squishy low defenses. Like, doing, like, like, outspeeding the attack. Yes, I can need to- Who has higher special defense? Um... Well, I thought it was- I thought it was, uh, Vormon, which is why I sent Vormon out. But I, I might have been Boo Boo the Fool on that one. Let's- let's- let's check my work here. Um... Okay, 29, 24... Okay, Mor Morgan has the high- has higher defense, 39. Zub Zub has 41. Okay, so Zub Zub does have high- the highest special defense. And high speed. So, like... Maybe Zub Zub's the way to go? It is- it is weak to Psychic. That is- that is the thing. We- we would be banking on Zub Zub, outspeeding the Kadabra, 
and killing it with bite. We, that's what we'd be banking it on. If it misses, if it um, doesn't attack first, I don't, I don't know if it'll tank the hit. I don't know. If it can get bite off first, we're good. Like I, I am pretty like like I. I- I'm pretty- I feel pretty confident that it could kill with a bite. I- You know? Super effective with X special. Your defense doesn't matter. You'll die if it's alive on its turn. I mean, that's fair. It does have a X special defense. X special, yeah. <sighs> bite or wing attack. They'll do the same amount of damage, lol. Well, but bites, um... Bite is super effective on Kadabra. Would that not matter? I mean, I guess there's also the stab on wing attack. I, I, this is the gen where super effective is 1.5 times, right? Uh, yes, I think so. I don't know. Um, I have no idea. Go for the bite. If it doesn't kill, you might get a flinch. Super effective. This is the fucking worst, you guys. The fucking worst. Um. <clears throat> um. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, type effectiveness. How much damage? Okay. Um. It says as but if a type of, of move is super effective against a type of type of its target, the damage is doubled. I don't know if it was twice or 1.5. Did that change? Oh, hold on. Type effect. Super effective. No. Damage. Hold on, let me look at the gen gen four damage calculator. Um, st st stab is one point five. Um, okay, type effectiveness is either one point five, not very effective, one normally effective, or two super effective. So, super a super effective move would do more damage than a move with stab, in theory. Kadabra zero defenses. That's crits. That's crits were nerfed. Bite will kill it. Yeah, I mean, I think bite will kill it. Yeah, crits they reduce. They did reduce crit crit chance. I think in this gen is like twice. I think in uh pre later gens, newer gens is one point five is crits. A crit, a crit crit is a uh, one point five amount of damage. At least I know if I die, then so does stuff. Thanks, Morgan. I appreciate your support. I appreciate you trying to help me in a- in this time. Okay, um... So what do you- what are you guys thinking? I hear a lot of zub zubs. Any- any other- any dissents? Oh man, I've been doing my damage couch all wrong for a while then! Oh no! It's okay, I- I didn't know- uh, I thought that Vormon would survive, uh, a psychic attack, which clearly it did not, so... Uh, we're both boo-boos the fools today. So... What do we- what do we think? I, I think Zub Zub or Bloons are our best option. I'm just enjoying the chaos! Thanks, Chaffamon. I appreciate your support as well. It's, it's, <sighs> Throw up more- <laughs> But I, I, Morgan's gonna, gonna eat it. Morgan is so gonna eat it if I send her out. She's gonna just, she's gonna get nuked. <laughs> she's gonna die. If you throw me out, I, don't worry, I'm not. I'm not. I'm trying to win. I'm not, tr I'm not trying to, trying to self, self-immolate here. Alright, so, I think the consensus is Zub Zub's the best bet. <sighs> So we just gotta pray that Zub Zub will get the bite off before Kadabra gets off confusion. I'm holding on. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> oh my god! 
god! <laughs> Holy shit! Wow! Where's the money bunny? I swear it'll make the money bunny so look at my disagreement. Oh oh my goodness. Um <laughs> This you know, having you put this quest in now now it's 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 making me choose between being a memester I know, yeah, I do. I, I, I'm, as much, as much as it's funny, uh, uh, Panda, I, I don't want to fuck this up. I feel like throwing Morgan out there would just get her dead, and I really want to have Rose Raid on my team. Rose Raid's really good, so, or has an option at the very least, so, um... Yeah, I'm gonna just- I'm gonna not do that. Uh, we'll throw out Morgan if we have no other options. <laughs> have your points back. i also mark that as complete. Okay, so... We're gonna do this. We're gonna send out Zub Zub. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. I feel like if Zub Zub guys, then it might be game over here. Alright, alright, Zub Zub. You gotta do this for me. You gotta kill this Kadabra! There's only, we only have one shot! You gotta do it, Kadabra. You gotta do this. Oh my god. I'm not- I'm not using Pistachio. Alright! Oh! Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my goodness! Uh, throw Panda out into the trash where they belong. I I can't do that, Morgan. I don't have the. I guess unless I like, like time them out for like a couple minutes. <sighs> Jesus. All right. All right. Well, I gotta head back to the. I gotta head back. Oh my god, my life flashed right before my eyes. I thought this was gonna be a TPK, but um, sad. thankfully, it was not. Oh my goodness. Thank god I have Golbat. Golbat is so fast. I am- I'm also so happy. I'm really grateful that, like, Zubat became a Golbat. Because if it wasn't a Golbat... Okay. Alright, you two. Panda, Morgan, settle down, or else I'll both time you out. <laughs> okay. Well, sadly. We have to retire some, some folks. Which is very unfortunate and sad. Um... Oh! Two Vors died today! Vormon lives! Vor Vormon and not Vor2? Okay. Alright, so that means Vor2's gotta go in the box. Any uh, but thank you for using the, the Max Revive. Alright, um... But... I'm sorry, Vor2. You are just getting good. Goodbye. All right. So let me set a note for myself. Let me indicate that my please all died. Did I note that uh, Orberg Mind Geodude died? Wait, which Geodude died? I have two Geodudes. Did I not? Hold on. One second, guys. I gotta figure out where I got... No, I got you in Orber Gate. This... G yeah. Oh, okay.
okay, I can, I can, oh my god, I can submit, I didn't realize this, guys, but in the, um, this is actually kind of cute. In the, in the, uh, the little web app I'm using right now, to keep track of stuff, uh, you can set memorials for the mods who've died. So we gotta do one for Jeff Bridges, and then we're gonna do one for Vortu, so hold on. Uh, the Judy got lucky with her move. Um, so, Jeff Bridges died dramatically. Nah, it wasn't a sacrifice. It, it wasn't- it wasn't a mistake, it wasn't bad luck. It was dramatic. It was a boss battle. The capture and defeat level. So capture level was like a 5, and I think it was like level 13. Um, opponent Pokemon. It was Rourke at Orbit Gym. Okay. Hello. It was not working. Cool. Alright, we gotta do the same thing for Buizel. So... Boar 2 was... Uh, that was a mistake on my part. I should've used- I should've used, uh, Pursuit and it might've been okay. But, uh... That was a trainer fight. Um... Capture level was... I wanna say, like... Probably 10, and then it was 21 when it died. Um, it was the scientist. Where are you? Scientist. It was against the Kadabra. Trainer name. I forget what the trainer name is. Hold on, we can find out. We can find out. <laughs> On Eterna City. Okay, yeah. Team Glotzik, Eterna Building. It was Scientist Trayvon who killed my poor guy. Fuck you, Scientist Trayvon! Oh, we can actually- we can actually change the- the epitaph here. I think. Can I? Yeah, hold on. Actually, I think Jeff Bridge was more of a, uh... Clay's Star Trek funeral song on Kudzu. Get in the pirate graveyard. Dub, set your box. I'm back, someone rise. Vormon lives. Get in the pirate graveyard. Dub, set your box. What? Someone should make gummy candies that are sweet and tasty, but with no sugar. Okay, so this one was like... Yeah, he was a sacrifice, actually, I think, Jeff.
For some reason, it like... It's like it's stuck whenever I do that. It's, it's kind of weird. Okay. Pirate Graveyard because it's called Graveyard. Oh! <laughs> yes. Okay. So, um... Let's see. Okay, so there's a couple options we have right now. Because we're now down in Pokemon. We still have to... Uh, finish the Galactic Eterna building, but I don't want to do that with only five mods. Um, so... So what we- oh geez. What we could do is we could go back to Route 205 and catch us another Dweezel. Um, since 205 has that as an option. Um, we could also have the Dweezel be like... Uh, um, or we could roll the dice and see if we get Heracross on that route instead. Um, those are our real options for, for that. Or we could put Cherubi on the team. Anyone hyped to have Cherubi? Oh, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, um, no one has ever been hyped after- <laughs> no. No, who would be? Not me. Oh, let me, uh... Oops, sorry. Turn it back. Okay, so... I want to... Um... Monferno... I want Beetleborg. Beetleborg? <laughs> oh, you mean Aircross? Okay, so here's- I'm gonna run another poll, because I'm obsessed with polls, and I can never shut up about them. Um, Now, uh, catch, okay, so here are the options, let me know what I should do, I also vote Beetleborg. Are we gonna be hair across? Well, I haven't caught hair across yet. So, so the options are, I can put Truby on the team for the time being. Um, I can rock five pokes until I get a Togepi, which won't be for too long because, um, I mean, assuming that I have five pokes until, <laughs> I don't know, uh, Jupiter could wreck my ass. Who knows? Um, I could rock five pokes until Togepi. We're gonna have- Togepi will be right around the corner. Um, sh uh, it'll be after we beat Jupiter. Um, then I get Togepi. Um, we can catch another Buizel now at Route 205. Um, is there any other places- are there any other places close-ish that I could catch coming up even? Let's see. Uh, well, okay. Okay, so as long as we don't lose Geodude, we're good for, for Route 206. That's when Gligar is gonna be happening. Uh, Wayward Cave is literally useless to us. Um, Mount Coronet does not have Weasel in it. Are there- can I catch anything in- I don't really think- I don't think I can catch anything at Mount Coronet. I don't think any of my options are- or it'd be dupes. Um... Uh... <laughs> Purple routes... 
in this hard home, we can't get the Eevee. Hmm. That one's another... Oh, well, Route 209, Spirit Tomb. Um, Lost Tower. Can't get anything in Exclamation Ruins. Is there another Buizel location? Alley Cat Ellie says hi! Oh, hello! Thank you for the raid, Marie! Hi! You've come to a, a sad moment. I lost two Pokemon very recently. <laughs> Both of them, Vormons. So, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. Although, uh, Psyduck has been, has been revived, so we're good on that. Um, but thank you for the raid. I really appreciate it. Okay! So, and right now we're trying to figure out what to do. Um, people are asking me to, I was asking if people wanted to me to rock five po uh, Pokemon into Togepi, put Cherubi on the team, which is this nerd over here, um, save 205 for possible Heracross, or, um, which is the, which is the only other route that I could get, um, Buizel on, or, um, catch a Buizel now so I have something else. Use a Pokemon game of Marie! <laughs> Equivalent exchange. Brain decided it wasn't a move streaming. That's to understandable, Marie. I under totally get that. Um, I vote two for Beetleborg. What is HC? Um, Heracross. Half the fun of Nuzlocke is using Pokemon you need to play with. I don't think you should use more than one of the same Pokemon at once. Oh, it's a dupe. Never mind. I've tried my throat then. No. Um, so HC's Heracross. I don't have Heracross yet. Um, Buizel would be a dupe. Um,. So, yeah, okay. So it seems like people are okay with me rocking five Pokemon until we get Togepi. Which shouldn't be too bad. Um, what are your- is it gonna be real bad if I don't have water types up ahead? No, no, we'll be all fine. It's just Zubat and Stun Tank, and then I think the other grunt is Wurmple, Silk, and Zubat, so I think we're fine. Um, or actually, hold on, I'm looking at the wrong- Sorry, I was looking at the wrong- I was looking at, a uh, looking at Diamond Pearl there. Um, so, the Galactic- uh, The last Galactic run I haven't fought yet is a Stunky, a Krogunk, and a Clam Meow. Yeah, so water type doesn't matter. Okay. <sighs> You're gonna lurk? Your brain just very sad and naughty KY? That's totally fine. Um... I appreciate the lurk and I appreciate the raid. Thank you so much. Um, for those of you who don't know me, because I just saw a new uh, chatter, I'm the Rational Dove. Uh, I'm a variety streamer, although today I'm playing a draft lock of Pokemon Platinum, which is basically a normal Nuzlocke, only I am restricted as to what Pokemon that I can uh, have on the team. And those Pokemon evolutionary lines are on like the bottom left-hand side of the screen. Um, that list, that, like, row of Pokemon are all the ones that I'm allowed to catch. So basically, on a route, it's instead of the first Pokemon that I find, it's the first, um, legal catch that I can get. So, um, and we just lost, as I said, two Pokemon. Vormon was saved from an ugly fate, but Vortu was, uh, not so lucky. So... We're gonna have to carry on without Vor 2, which that's. Of all the Pokemon to lose, Vor 2 is not terrible, um, but still not great. Okay, so. We're gonna get. Um, I'm gonna actually buy some more healing items. I think the thing that's really fucking me up right now is I can't. As part of this challenge, I can't heal mid battle. So I feel like it might be a better for me to obsessively heal, like, outside of battle way more um, than I do already. Like, it, like, in between each fight, you know, like, even if the Pokemon is, like, if the Pokemon's, like, kind of close to halfway out of battle, I should probably heal it so I top it off so that there's more. I think that's probably why Vormon went down as fast as it did, because... Its health was not all the way up. It might have it might have lived otherwise, but what are you gonna do? What is your draft lock? Uh, draft lock is um, 
a, uh, basically, as I explained, <laughs> so much explanation, re-explanation and explanation and re-explanation and explanation. Um, I can, so it's all the standard Nuzlocke rules apply, except I can only use the, I think it's like 17 evolutionary lines that you see at the bottom of the screen underneath the like main screen of all the Pokemon. Um, so that includes Zubat line, Psyduck line, uh, Geodude line, Heracross, Togepi line, Budu line, Chimchar line, Snorunt line, um, Scroopy line, Girafferig, Weasel line, Elekid line, Gligar line, Krellagunk line, uh, Remoraid line, Azelf, Azuro line, Spiritomb, and Truby line. Those are all the Pokemon that I can have on the team. <laughs> so, very slim pickings. Um, thankfully, I have a lot early games, so that's been helpful. Um, but, um, yeah. And all the other rules apply. Um, I'm also, my other rule that I'm using is I am not allowed to heal mid-battle, which is new for me. I, that's something I never did in, my, in any of my other previous attempts at a Nuzlocke, so uh, it makes it even harder. <laughs> Yeah, that's okay. Also, I'm Morgan. Um, yes, you're you are a Budu. Okay, I beat you, so we can go up here. I think it's just items. Yeah, do shard, and what else? Revive. Oh hey, I probably need to sell that. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could save my revives in case someone revives something and I'm like, I can't go get to a Pokemon Center easily or whatever, but we can't use them. Also, I'm a Morgan. Like, that's my name. You are, yes. You're, you're both a Budu and a Morgan. Alright. So this is the last grunt fight before the boss. I think. Oh, never mind. Oh. Save the revives, yeah. Okay. So we're fully healed, correct? We're fully healed, right? Okay. I'm thinking... You guys can let me know, but I'm thinking about, um, bumping up the, the two, the, the three 21s to 22s. So we have a little bit of an easier time with, um, um, I won't go, go to 23, but I was thinking about bumping them up to 22. Thoughts? Thoughts? Do we want to do that? Would that be cheating? Did you- yes. Uh, yes. I do have infinite rare candies. I didn't get the one with the healing items working, but I did get infinite rare candies. And I'm honestly not gonna push my luck. I'm not gonna bother getting infinite healing items. I've been selling a lot. And with the amount of rare candies I have, if I need more money, I can just sell rare candies and get enough healing anyway, so it's fine. <laughs> so, cause like, if you're avoiding FDAC grinding, you can avoid cash grinding too, that seems fair, yeah. I'm not a Budu, the Budu is me, gets you straight up. So, I think, I think since we're using rare candies, I might, uh, it's funny you should say that, Dove. I think I'm bumping up to a 6,800 6, XT. What does that mean? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, sell candy. Oh, do you mean like, um, is it like a computer thing? Um... Yeah, I could sell candy to get more more healing items. I mean, I'm fine right now. I don't feel like I'm gonna need like 12 super potions here in a moment, but yeah, we could get like a whole bunch of stuff and just be set for like the rest of the game. <laughs> I could definitely spend, I mean, what would be handy is to use the money in order to buy like TMs and stuff if I want them, which would be good. Um, maybe buy even multiples if I want. I was just grabbing around just messing with you because numbers! Man, that's rude. Anyway. So, yeah, you know what? I've already been using square candy, so I'm gonna bump myself up to level- to make everyone level 22, just to make this a little easier... on me. Rollout. Um... I don't really think rollout's gonna be a good move for a Nuzlocke. Locking myself into a move is kind of a bad decision. And like, I mean it is, I think rock throw will be fine for me for the time being. Yes, the, I will be careful not to overlevel. 
I'm trying to keep all of my levels like kind of what I'm doing is I'm getting all my Pokemon like basically I average out the levels of the of the Pokemon so in this case there's two Pokemon a level 21 Zubat level 23 stun tank so so that's like an average of 22 so if I have my whole team average 22 then like I think I should be on par for the for the fight you know what I mean um but yeah I do want to make sure I don't over level I mean, if, if people think that it would be a bad idea for me to keep going and just leave it as is, then that's fine, too. Um, I'm just really, I'm just really scared of having been in what people die. <laughs> that's all. <laughs> but yeah, I don't over level. That would suck. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm gonna skip out and roll out. I don't think, I don't think that would be a good idea. Okay, um... I am actually going to, I'll leave Vormon at level 21, but I'll keep everybody else level 22. Uh, UCA is going to be the MVP for this fight because um, it'll be able to take care of Zubat and also Stun Tank. I will leave, um, who is a backup? Uh, Stun Tank's going to be the biggest threat, so... We want people who aren't weak to dark or poison. I mean, Morgan's not going to care about dark type, poison type, although it doesn't really have a lot of moves to like do damage to stun tank, so I don't know if it'll be... Actually, Zub Zub might be better. Zub Zub might be a better neutral choice. Um, same thing with Vormon. Uh, Bloon, same thing with Vormon. Morgan's kind of- Morgan's not gonna be bad for this particular fight, but she's not gonna be great either, so I'll put her in the- in the back. <laughs> okay. Alright, so we're gonna save. I don't remember if, like, I have to- if it starts here. But we're gonna save. <sighs> I'm always so nervous whenever there's a major fight. <laughs> Just wait till I evolve! Yeah, it'll be really nice when you evolve. I also have to start, like, I also could buy a bunch of, like, to, like, compensate for the fact that I'm using so many rare candies, I could just buy a bunch of, like, vitamins and stuff and, like, try and max out EVs and IVs that way. So that, like, it, like, I can compensate for that. Then I'll be Super Morgan. <laughs> All right. Here we go. And did you want something? Let me buh, buh, buh. All right, let's go. Oh my God, no, no, the Zubat doesn't have Giga Drain. Holy shit, holy shit. Oh no, okay, Whew. we got a crit, that's good. Um, well, my plan against stun tank kind of doesn't know, doesn't work anymore. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck. Good thing you got to level two. <laughs> yeah, yeah, good thing. Oh, uh, if I hadn't, UCA might be dead right now. <laughs> Holy shit. Um, okay, so... I don't think it'd be a good idea for me to put UCA out against Sun Tank. I don't trust it to take a Night Slash. Uh, Zub Zub. Zub Zub might be the best option because, like, it has Wing Attack, which will do neutral damage against Sun Tank, and it's Sun Tank's other moves. Poison Gas it doesn't give shit about Night Slash. Hold on. Um, maybe it'll tell me, this thing tells me, like, the, like, little thing I'm using will tell me how much damage shit will do to me, uh, at level cap, so, maybe I should've, <laughs> this is what I was afraid of, <laughs> okay, um,
Okay, so... Let's see, we want... Oh, I should note that Zubat became a Golbat. You evolved into a Golbat! Yay! Woo, Golbat. Okay. So, compare defensively. Oh, jeez! Night Slash will do 30, about 30 damage, 40% of the health. That's... That's not great. <laughs> That's not great. Oh, I don't know. I mean... It's defense isn't the highest thing in the world. And I will outspeed. So that's good. But we gotta be careful. Um... What else? Let's see. What does they say about Monferno? Monferno... So... Oh yes, that's right. I forgot. Monferno resists dark type, I'm pretty sure. So... It will only do like 20, da 20 damage to it, which isn't too bad. Um, the only problem is that I don't... Right? Am I right? It's time to think. Trick bat. It has What? Uh, stunt, stunt tank? I don't think stunt tank has flamethrower. I think it has... No, it, it has night slash, poison gas, smoke screen, and screech. That is the stuff. Um, oh, it tells me what it's, what it's resists. So... Um... Yeah, so, gra so like, I will do neutral damage with Monferno, and Monferno will take less damage from its only real damaging move. Um, and Mach, I mean, Mach Punch doesn't have as big of a power, but it is priority. Maybe that, yeah, no, it's, no, this thing does not have Flamethrower, so... Um, yeah, I feel like my best bets, I don't want to even think about putting out Psyduck. That's not really going to do us much, much of anything, really. Uh, um, Budu is going to get fucking wrecked and can't even really dish anything out. So, and I mean, like, Geodude would be kind of great for this, but especially if magnitude went off really well but again with that with that really with that 12 hp like no it's gonna get it's gonna get killed so okay so honestly considering the the defensive capabilities i feel like monferno might be the better option here because it'll still get out damage with mock punch and with Ember uh, and with Flame Wheel. I forgot about Flame Wheel. Flame Wheel will also do a lot of damage. Um, the only issue is that Flame Wheel uh, looks like base stat wise. I'm probably gonna be I'm gonna be slower than um probably right. Hold on. Uh, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be slower, right? Yeah, I'm gonna be slower than, uh, yeah, I'm gonna be slower than the, uh, than, than the stun tank, so, uh, I just gotta hope that, um, I, again, it, that's not as huge big a deal, because Night Slash is not gonna do as much damage to, um, to Nonferno, but, I should DM Dove, I was curious when Gem 4 Wrong Heist might suggest. Um, I haven't played that many, actually. I mean, I've heard about Regan Negade Platinum, that's the only big one I know about. Um, that one's like a harder version of, um, of Platinum. The only ROM hacks of Platinum I've played is a Randomizer Nuzlocke, but that's just a mod. That's honestly more of a modded version of Platinum rather than a ROM hack. <sighs> Damn, I, I hate not knowing what to do. Um. So here, this, this is the thing, right? It's either, it's either I, I... I get speed with Zub Zub and attack more often at the cost of, of taking less damage. I mean, the other thing to, conti to, to consider about Night Slash is it has an increased critical hit chance. So, like, it might be better <laughs> to have a Pokemon that has better defenses just, just, to, just to make the extra crit chance a little bit easier to swallow. So... Okay, I think that's what I'm gonna go for. I wonder if self-destruct would've been good here. 
I mean, if I wanted to have Geodude go out in a blaze of glory, sure. All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna make that my final answer. My final answer is Bloons, given given what I'm looking at here at the at the thing at the helper thing. So yeah, I have how much power is Flame Wheel? Flame Wheel's got Flame Wheel will do more damage than Mock Punch, but uh. Chonky boy here is not is gonna outspeed, so it's gonna be a bit of a risky play. But hopefully, um, the fact that it do less damage will help. Okay. And we can hopefully get a burn off, which would be nice. And then stun tank would do way less damage. Okay. <sighs> oh, I outsped. Oh, that's good. Oh my god, that did such little damage! Okay. We're kind of even in terms of damage output. Oh my god, we're speed tied. That's not- that's not great either. At least it missed. Please burn. Oh my god. Okay, defense lowering. Whew, that's not great. Especially with night nightshade. Okay, or night- yeah, night slash, excuse me. Oh, and it has the citrus berry. Fuck. Alright. Please outspeed. Oh my god. Oh my god, I don't want to lose balloons. Mm -hmm. Oh my god! Oh, what do I do? Oh, fuck. There's always battle items. I sold all of mine. I also- I'm not gonna use battle items. Like, right now wouldn't be a good- like, the problem with battle items is like, I mean they're good, but you just gotta use them judicious, ju judiciously because, um, like, you know, you're using a turn to buff. Which can be a good idea, but, um, you know, you then risk, like, oh no, what if Bloons gets, what if, what if Stunting Tate gets a crit on me? You know what I mean? Like, that kind of thing you gotta think about, too. And if you don't, if you, you could have spent the, the turn you didn't buff, like, going for it. Okay. Fuck, what am I gonna do here? Oh, this fucking sucks, man. <laughs> Um, okay, I hate to say this, but I, I, I also feel like battle, I do agree with Garjar too, I feel like battle items would also make it way easier, you know, like, I feel like I could either only use battle items, I, I don't even really think battle items are allowed in this particular challenge anyway, I have to reread the challenge again, um, that it's- I know healing isn't allowed, but it might have extended to, like, like, that also- it also includes, like, not using battle items in the middle, so... Uh, holy shit, this is, like... Oh, I think it's probably pinned tweet, yeah. No items in battle! Yep, so I can't. I can't use battle items. So that's- that's- that's off the table. That includes healing, and it also includes, um, boosting stats. I mean, it's not a bad suggestion, Morgan. It's just, I can't do it. So, I think, I hate to say it, but I feel like the best move here is gonna be to, uh, to have balloons be sacrificed. And then I switch into Zub Zub to finish Stunt Tank off. If I do Mock Punch, I'll at least guarantee that I'll outspeed the Stunt Tank. I don't think I'll kill it, but I'll at least get it to like very low health. And then Zub Zub can go in for the finisher. I guess the only other thing to consider is um, does Jupiter have healing items? <laughs> Will it heal? Will she heal the stun tank? Do we know? Can somebody in chat tell me? Is that a possibility? I need to know, because that would help. 
Cause, cause then the other option is to take a chance on. I have no idea. <sighs> cool. Cause then the other thing is like, I could ch cause, um, flame wheel will do more damage. So if I outspeed, then I will, I will probably more chance to outright kill it. Don't stack sack your starter though. I don't want to sack my starter, but I, I don't know what else to do. Like, I don't want to switch out. Because if it uses a night slash, I don't know, like... Okay, because like, here's the other option, right? The other option, I guess, option four, is I switch for Zub Zub. And have Zub Zub take the night slash that I'm assuming this thing's gonna use. Um, it'll do a lot of damage to... Zub Zub, because Zub Zub won't resist and has weaker defenses, but um, it'll probably outspeed the stun tank. Your other option is to sack. Can't you sack Geodude? Your other option is to sack any other Pokemon. I I guess I could sack. I could sack somebody else. I could sack Geodude. I didn't think about that. Geodude would probably be better of a sacrifice in theory because I could catch another one. I, I just- I don't see it. I want a clean switch in for Zub Zub. Um... To guarantee that I, like, get a clean- I need, I need a clean switch in in order to kill a sun tank. <laughs> no! You know what, Morgan? I did not- I did not get the rawest deal for this, uh, particular challenge. Kellerby had the- had way worse options than me. He was using, what, Cricket Tot? His starter was a why not? He had Phoebus on his. Like he had a pretty a pretty uh, challenging run. Okay. Okay. You guys make a good point. You guys make a good point. Sacking Geodude is probably the better option. Thank you. Okay. This thing doesn't have pursuit, so I don't have to worry about that. Alright, UCA. Maybe it'll use, like, no, okay, use light sound. I was like, maybe it'll use, like, smoke screen or something. <sighs> Second Geodude down. God, three Pokemon died today. That's, that's a record. All right. All right, Zub Zub, you're up. You gotta, you gotta do me a fucking solid for me, buddy. All right, we're gonna use wing attack to ensure the most amount of damage because it won't resist and I get stabbed. Oh, I- what? Really? Okay, that actually didn't do as much damage as I thought. Oh, oh, oh my god! Oh my god. Alright, one more. All we need is one more. How are you slower? Oh, you're gonna do it, you're gonna do it. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, we did it! Okay, oh my- Whew. Oh! Zub Zub is the main MVP, honestly. Oh. Holy shit. Okay. Yay! Okay. Oh, upgrade. For the Porygon I don't have. <laughs> This is very sad. All right. Wow. So this isn't the, the Geo dudes have been dying the same way. They're both. All of them have been. Um. All right, UCA. You have. You are dead. This was a. You were a sacrifice. All right. I'll let you guys see me. Um. Input all the shit here. Um. If I can. Actually, let me get to the actual- hold on. Let's- let's get to the- the- the, um... The Pokemon Center so we can have the sad- the sad Pokemon Center music playing in the background. That would be more. I'm gonna send this to, po to Pokemon challenges so he can viciously critique our choices here. I- sure, if you want to! If you want to. I've- I've made some mistakes. That's happened before. Alright. Uh, 
Okay. Into the graveyard. I only have four Pokemon. <laughs> okay. UCA, Geodude. I caught, actually it'll tell me here what level I caught. I forgot about that. I caught you at level five. Defeat level 22. And then it was Jupiter. It always freezes up like that whenever I do that. Damn it. Okay. We will miss you. Okay, um, so I don't think I can actually get a new Geodude for a while. Yeah, I don't think I can get one. In well, actually, remember when I s remember how I said that like, oh shit, oh that's not good. We might not be able to get Gligar because of dupes. Oh, well, I guess dupe claws is still dupe claws. It's fine. Um, I can elect not to catch the Geodude there. I think I'm gonna go for Geodude in Wayward Cave, though. I'll replace my Geodude with a different Geodude in Wayward Cave, since there's no other things I can get there anyway. So I might as well do that there. I think he'd give you props recognizing you need to sack. Um, I doubt he'd actually watch it, but I guess I'm gonna say that. Ha, I was just joking. I'm sorry. No, no, don't worry about it. I, you know, I make a lot of weird decisions. So I understand, and I, 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 you know, what you gonna do? Okay, um, so, uh, do we wanna bother? Do we wanna bother? Do we wanna bother with Cherubi at all? Cause we're gonna be rocking four, we're gonna be rocking five Pokemon. Um, well, I guess we'll be at Route 206 really soon here in a moment, so... We'll probably catch Gligar pretty quickly. Um, yeah, we might catch Gligar pretty quickly. Unless, of course, there's some way you could have gotten out of that. <laughs> I don't. I don't think there was. I Truby could have been could have been sack fodder. I regret. Oh yeah, Truby could have been sack fodder. Well, you know, in that spirit, maybe we should put Truby. <laughs> on the uh on the team for that particular purpose i mean i don't 
think any of the trainers up ahead are gonna do anything to me, but then again, that scientist fucking wrecked, like, a good chunk of my team, so who's to say what will happen? So we'll, we'll put Cherubi as a placeholder for now, and then we'll keep going for Heracross. Yeah, well, the Name Raider is in this city, yeah, so I could Name Raider. Alright, I'm gonna have to, uh, uh, call it soon. But, um, before I do that, let's get ourselves our Togepi, you guys! Ooh! This is the one Pokemon I've been waiting for. Oh, I'm so hyped. I love, I love myself. Oh, I have to hatch the egg. Damn it. Damn it. Chad Scientist, what's the battle? Can I name Truby? Uh was Truby already named? Uh un unfortunately Truby was named by chat, so no, you cannot name the Truby. Unless people unanimously vote that they want to change the name that was given to it originally, which was Mr. Stabby. <laughs> Let me know if that's if that's what chat wants to do. Oh, never mind. I think you forgot to switch back. Oh, I did. You're right. Thank you. I'm so sorry. Here we go. Alright, we're gonna go. I mean, I gotta use the name Raider team to, to rename Struby anyway. Back to. Oh, I gotta heal too. Holy crap. Because I accidentally. Uh... Where were you gonna. You were gonna call it Mulch? That's a pretty good name. And I think it's the kind of name that Truby deserves. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, but. Hey, if, if we happen to get another Truby, you know. Why is it? I have no idea. Um, that was just the name that people gave it. I, there wasn't a lot of people. Oh yeah, it was. Um, it was. There wasn't a lot of people when I caught the Cheru because I I caught it. Um, not off stream. I did catch it while I was streaming, but it was like kind of not when I normally stream and I didn't advertise it, so not people showed up. So that's more why. Oh, hold on, let me. All right, let me go. Heal. I think I think Panda might have been in. So if Panda's still around, or the next time we see Panda, we could ask them if they want me to like change the name, and then if they're okay with me changing the name. And I think I think if 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 they think if people think that like that name is better than. I don't mind changing it. Okay, well, I'm gonna end stream here. Um, this was quite the quite the eventful stream. We lost a lot of boys, which is unfortunate, but um, we're on the way to getting some more onto the team. Um, I have Togepi in this egg that we're gonna hatch probably next time, and then I also have this. Um, Gligar is going to be our next new capture, which I'm really excited about. Love that guy. Um, and then we'll probably get another Geodude in the Wayward Cave, just so we have one. Um, although, actually, we could just wait until um, Mount Coronet and catch one there. That might not be a- that might be even better. We could even catch one- we can even catch one in Mount Coronet right here in Eternal City before we even leave. Um... So, I don't know which one people would prefer, if they even prefer it, uh, but I forget, I forget that there's that route to the, uh, to the south. Togepi, you did what in the egg? I, I, it's, that's the beam of the Pokemon, Gardrak! I actually might, might, um, talk to one of some of the trainers and fight them, just to maybe... Especially like to get Togepi up to snuff, um, and level level it up, and then um, 
once we do that, um, then I, I can catch Geodude, and then we can add a Geodude to the team, so we have that. Um, eventually, we're, now we're eventually, soon we're gonna have to start choosing Mons, like, what we want to have on the team. Um, which is gonna be tough, I don't know, I don't know who to get rid of and stuff. We're gonna have a lot of flying types on the team, actually. There's poison, we have poison flying, ground flying, and, well, we might not even need to get a new Geodude if we have a ground flying type on the team. Well, I guess we don't really have an answer for flying types otherwise, except for Elkid. Uh, but... Uh, that, we can make that discussion later as to what Pokemon we want to have, um, on the team. Um, I think I would prefer to have the new guys on the team more so than the Geodude. But we could always put the Geodude on if we think having Rock Ground is better. Honestly, I feel like, I feel like, um, uh, blah, 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 blah. Gligar and Togepi would be just better overall. I don't care what team comp it's a composition, I'm just here to make dumb jokes remind you to kill the rock with arms. <laughs> yeah, I think, I, I mean, I feel like, I feel like getting Geodude isn't super necessary unless we, like, run out of shit. So, um, or if we want to have, like, something in the back pocket, in the, you know, so we can, in case some, something tragic happens. So, but anyway, thanks everybody for watching. Um, for next week's stream schedule, um, cause I'm not streaming for the rest of the, rest of the week. I'm busy Thursday, I'm busy tomorrow, Friday, and Saturday, so I cannot stream. If I could type, that would be excellente. Okay. Calendar. Um, let's see. We... Okay, so... Um, I have stream Thursday. Um, alright, okay, so it'll be Monday. I'll be back with, uh, I like Dub, thank you. Well, I hope you had a good week, Dub. Thank you. I did have a good week. Well, it's been kind of busy at work, actually. I've been very stressed. I have some stuff I gotta do before the end of the fiscal year turns up, so that's been a little bit stressful. Um... And I also had my car recalled, so I have to handle that. Just a lot of stuff I gotta take care of. Um, let's see, so we have... Um, so I have stream... Yeah, okay, so it's gonna be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday in a row is gonna be stream. Um, I'm, I don't know what's happening for my... For... For... Um... Because I'm going to be away on the weekend, but I haven't decided yet if I'm going to be, like, away for, like, how many days or whatever. Like, I don't know yet. I wish I could help. That doesn't sound fun at all. It's not! It's not fun at all! I might... Hmm. I might... No. Well, even if I... I guess I'll have to see if I have D&D &D that's the next Friday. If I don't, I might stream... I don't know, I don't like streaming three days in a row if I can help it, so I might move that to that day. Well, actually, I can't even do that anyway, because it's going to be when I... Actually, never mind. <laughs> it's going to be Monday through Tuesday, Tuesday, Friday. Monday will either be... Um, 